Today we are going to discuss about mixing. Now first of all, <coughs> what is mixing? Now mixing is a process in which two components are mixed to each other. Here we can see that here E and B both are individual components. But when they are mixed to each other, it forms AB. It is called as mixture. And the whole process, it is called as mixing. Now we are moving towards the types of mixing. Now there are mainly three types of mixing. Positive mixing, negative mixing and neutral mixing. Now first of all positive mixing. Now positive mixing is a spontaneous process and it is irreversible. And it does not require any kind of energy for the mixing to two components. Here whenever two miscible liquids or two miscible gases are mixed to each other and it forms the positive mixing. Now negative mixing. It is uh, opposite to the uh, positive mixing it requires higher energy to the mix for the mixing and it is reversible in nature like suspension and uh, emulsions uh, long time it will get separated due to the lesser energy and it is called as negative mixing now neutral mixing neutral mixing are the mixing it is very difficult to mix as well as difficult to demix now demixing is a process of segregation it is also called as segregation now in case of neutral mixing when the th when these two components are mixed it is very difficult because it requires higher energy for the mixing but once the energy will apply for mixing and they mix it they will not be now mechanisms of mixing now how mixing takes place there are mainly four mechanisms by mixing take place first one is bulk transport molecular diffusion, laminar flow as well as the turbulent flow. Now first one is bulk transport. Now movement of particle or movement of solvent into the one location from, from one location to another location. It is called as bulk transport mechanism. And due to that bulk transport mechanism mixing can take place. Second one is molecular diffusion. Now molecular diffusion is a primary mechanism for the mixing, mixing process. Most of the mixing can be done by molecular diffusion only and it depends on the fixed flow and according to uh, fixed first flow dm by dt is equal to minus da dm upon dx now here dm by dt is a rate of diffusion while dm by dx is a concentration gradient so we can say that diffusion is directly proportional to the concentration gradient and here e is the surface area as the surface area increases, the mixing process also will be increases. Now second one is laminar flow. Laminar flow. Now when the liquids are viscous in nature, when the mixture of that solution is become very viscous, at that time flow will be like laminar because fluid velocity is decreasing and due to that only the mixing can be happened by the laminar flow only. Now fourth one is turbulent flow. Now turbulent uh, flow is a randomized fluctuation in the velocity of the liquid. And uh, due to that the velocity of liquid will be very high. And due to that mixing will be occur. Due to the difference in velocity, higher difference and lower difference will be mixed to each other and forms the uniform mixture. And mixing can be occur.